It's War from the Planet of the Apes on the Kosher Critic. We created this. But now... We will bring an end to their kind. The Planet of the Apes, a stable of cinema for over 50 years, returns with the war for the Planet of the Apes, and it revolves around central Jewish concepts. Firstly, we learn that the cornerstone of ape law is ape together strong, or as we say in Judaism, we have to lerecha kamocha. You should love your neighbor like yourself. Practically speaking, that means you should strive to make your fellow's pain your pain and your fellow's joy your joy. And that's something we see repeated time and time again throughout this movie. But what makes it so specifically Jewish is we see it repeated across a whole myriad of circumstances. We see the apes at peace, we see the apes at war, we see the apes subjugated in captivity, and we see the apes tasting the sweet air of freedom. And throughout of it, a central concept they have is ape together the strong via half the recha kamocha. This is a particularly relevant message for this time of year when we commemorate the destruction of the Beit HaMikdash, the Jewish temple in Jerusalem, and the beginning of this 2000 year exile we still endure to this day. As sages tell us that this happened because we lost focus on the idea of via the recha kamocha, loving your neighbor. So to put that into context for you, that means any piece of oppression that anybody has experienced for the last 2,000 years because they are a Jew, be they the Crusades or pogroms or the Holocaust or the rabid anti-Zionism we see today and the BDS movement and boycotts, that all happens because we as a nation forgot the central basic truth of love your neighbor like yourself. Or as Caesar the Ape would say, ape together strong.